Hi. Happy Monday, everyone. Um, it's been a while, so I forgot to say hi and do a book review. So today's book review is uh, Wedding Wipeout by Jacob Appel. I don't have the book because it was an ebook I got for free. So, um, and if you didn't notice, I did give a thumbs down. I did not finish it. I got to page 89 and I had to stop. And I'll tell you the reason why. First of all, this is not the first book by Jacob Appel I've read. I love his short story books. And he basically writes, he incorporates Judaism throughout his books. I guess because he's Jewish. I have no problem with that. His novels, I'm not a fan of. Up so far, the novels I read, I'm really not a fan of. Um, so this was a novel. That's what he might have. It was not his short story collection. So um, it was a murder mystery. And two elderly women had this will where they, if they married, they would lose the money their father um, left to them. So the one sister um, got married. She broke the will. And the night of her wedding, she died. And they said it was an asthma attack. However, things, people think there's something afoul with that. So it focuses on this rabbi. And the rabbi's protege, who worked for a lawyer for him now, comes to him and says, look, I think she was murdered. I need you to investigate. It's like, OK, so him and his newest protege investigate. There was a few things why I didn't like it and why I stopped at page 89. First of all, if I had to read one more page saying rabbinic reasoning, I was going to scream. Every single page said those two words, rabbinic reasoning. I'm like, seriously, too much, too much repeating. It's like, are you freaking kidding me? I get what rabbinic reasoning is. You have to say it on every single page. I'm like, I can't read anymore because I just don't want to. And then the other thing that irritated me the most was Steinmetz, his protege, his newest protege. He was always against the rabbi. No matter what the rabbi said, he fought against them. And it was just annoying. He was just an annoying character. So it kind of threw me off. It kind of pushed me away. Like, I was really curious as to see how she died or who killed her. But I was like, I just don't care now. A, I don't want to keep saying those words over and over again. And B, I hate Steinmetz. So... No, I'm done. Sorry, Jacob. If it's not my favorite, I'm hopefully the next book I read is going to be your short story collection again because I have a few more years I have to read. So, not on this one. Zip. Thumbs down. All right, guys. That's it for today. Hopefully everybody's staying safe. And yes, I'm starting to go stir crazy being in this house for so long. But hopefully next month we'll start opening up again and I can get back to work. Until then... Happy reading, guys, and see you later. Bye.